Don't be startled. I survived because I hid down here. Utterly frightened and all spiked up. So, uh, there's no backstory here. We're just a tamarin, and these bugs just kind of rolled up and gunned down all our homies. So I'm hell-bent on revenge. I mean, look at this. I have an Uzi now. We're going to gun down all these giant bugs. Get out of here, bird boy. Save yourself. Dude, I don't like normal-sized bugs. Forget about giant bugs. Oh, did that one bleed? You know who else is dead? My bird friends, because you just showed up and pumped them full of bullets. Oh, I could do this all day long. I'll shoot bugs. Tamarin might as well just open an exterminating business. Just a quick side hustle. Oh, we got some pink boys hiding. Oh, it looks like that's gonna open a gate. I mean, look at him. He's adorable, but he's armed to the teeth. Oh, uh, whoops. I, um, I don't think I was supposed to shoot the bird. I didn't know I was gonna have to make morality choices in Tamarin. Okay, so what are these little bug things that I'm collecting? Are they skulls? Am I collecting the skulls of my enemies? Oh, hang on. Oh, uh, I couldn't get out of the way in time, but thankfully that didn't kill me. Now, what have we learned? I think we've learned not to cross this little monkey or really any monkeys in general. Woo! I mean, think about it. Donkey Kong's got a coconut gun. Tamarin's got a real gun. Don't worry, bird, I will spare you. I didn't know I could hurt them. Oh, wait, so I can either save or kill birds? Why do I have that option? Dude, I want to say this music hits, but it's David Wise, so I'm not surprised at all. The hell are those? We gotta play like some space invaders here? Or Galaga? Oh, I have to aim within the aim. That makes sense. So, quick shout out to Chameleon Games for sponsoring this video and hooking me up with Tamarin to play so I can shoot some really buff bugs. They also didn't tell me what I was supposed to do here, so just prepare to... Okay, he died. Do good games even really need complicated stories? This one, it makes total sense to me. Oh, I almost gunned down this hedgehog. Who would have thought, little Emperor Tamarin? Your meekness is a weakness. You just never give up. A machine gun? Hell yeah! I feel like the Scarface of the primates. Say hello to my little friend! Dude, what? Hey, hey, this is like- this is like Galaga. Dude, he just shot him straight in the head! I don't know how he didn't die, that bird's completely untouched. Okay, we're just blowing bugs to bits. Say that five times fast. And I dig it, I don't like bugs, no one likes bugs. I'll shoot every bug. Except for ladybugs. Ladybugs get a pass. All right, we cleared the forest and we only murdered two birds. Dude, I like these hedgehogs just chilling all over the place. What do you have to say? You made it past the nasty ant Arby. Up ahead is Freda Bowen, a peaceful Bowen. We'll see about that. Okay, yeah, so maybe it is a little peaceful. Psych! Where's my little hedgehog friend? I want my Uzi back. I want my peace. It's gonna bite me, isn't it? Yeah, I see that, that thing rattling. That means get the hell out of here. Let's see. Whew, okay. Fun fact, I saw the movie Anaconda when I was young and uh, I had nightmares for a while. I was deathly afraid of snakes of that size. See, in Mario games, you would have to do this and you would get coins. Oh, he got squashed by his own rock. Well, that's one way to go. Oh, here he is. Am I gonna get my guns back? I've been expecting... Oh, I have to give him the voice, I'm sorry. I've been expecting you. He he sounds kind of nerdy. Helpless little critter. No, 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 you are not. Let me tell you, I've been craving red berries for some... Well, lucky for you, I have 26 of them. Oh, I didn't even get the guns. I got the spring... Damn it. Dude straight up took my guns from me, said, Don't worry, I'll keep these safe for you, and then tried to sell them back to me. What kind of Angelica Pickles level scheme is that? It's funny because this rock wall is not that high and it's also looks like it's built by a five-year-old. Do I really need a springboard to get over it? I collect these fireflies. I don't know what they do yet. This game kind of feels like Banjo-Kazooie like mixed with a Donkey Kong game mixed with... You ever play Buck Bumble? Okay, uh, need seven fireflies to open that door, which I don't have seven. Oh, we got to put the birds back. Okay, what does that give us? No way three of you are fitting in there. I say it all the time, I'm just a sucker for 3D platformers and any games that were inspired by the golden era of 3D platformers. So late 90s, early 2000s, your typical Mario, Crash Bandicoots, Banjo-Kazooie, even though I never really played much of Banjo, so I think we're gonna do a playthrough of a Banjo game eventually. You want it, right? Tell me you want it. Help me with the algorithm and let me know in the comment section if you want it.
Look at this, this game is not realistic at all. I'm a monkey that can read. You know what, it's probably not fair for me to say that monkeys can't read because I'm sure there is a monkey out there who has learned to read. You guys are all lucky that I don't have my Uzi. Do you know what would happen then? The audacity of these four-armed bugs throwing rocks at me. Good, come out, you little coward. Come out. Oh wait, you're already dead. Welcome to Choctopus Yells at a Corpse on YouTube.com. Please like and subscribe for more. You see, Tamarin, everything the light touches is your kingdom. Hey, what's that place over there? That's New Jersey, son. Just don't go there. What's this thing? Ground pound? I, although I feel like I'm going to need my fire. Oh, it's a time trial. Okay. I got you, I got you. And I'm going to kill some bugs along the way. Probably not the best idea. See, this is the speed run strat. I don't know where I'm supposed to. Where is it? It's hiding. Uh, it's still beeping. <laughs> How do I make it stop? Let's try this again. See, I just, I didn't want to get it on the first try, that's all. You know, I wanted to see if you guys knew where it was. Yeah, that's it. Okay, by the house. Attempt number three. See, I didn't want to get the other one anyway. That, the other one was too easy. I wanted to get the way harder one to prove that I'm an accomplished gamer. I go catch the bug now? Where is it? Come here. Wait, where are you going? Come back. You are currency in this world. Now I got it. Why are those bugs normal size, but the other bugs are giant? All right, we got seven fireflies now, so I think we could advance to the next area. Open sesame. We going to a snow level? I, I don't know why I thought we were going into a snow level, but uh, we're at a factory now. Is this a, did we just crash a bug rave? Is that what's happening here? Listen, they're just vibing. They're not bothering it. I mean, they did kill my friends, so. Oh, so I guess it's time to light them up. I want to talk to your boss. Who's the boss? Are you one of those buff bugs? I feel like we're coming really close to a boss fight. This seems like the place to do it. We're just kicking the door down to the insect factory. I want to talk to Mr. Insect. Hang on, can I... I can definitely blow up those. <laughs> That's what I wanted to do. Oh, I'm supposed to save the birds, but... Occupational hazard. They, they should have known by being in the factory. This is an alternate universe where Diddy Kong goes off on his own. He finds DK's coconut gun, and he's like, uh-uh, I'm done shooting peanuts. I want the heavy artillery. Oh, there's two birds here. Okay, so we're gonna save them because balance. Okay, that looks bad down there, so... I'm gonna... Actually, no, it's fine. But yeah, but you see, I jumped down here on purpose because I wanted you to know that it was okay, in case you guys didn't know. Now oh, we're gonna play a quick round of Galaga. See, it's hard to platform with the gun, because I can't do, like, any of my dive tricks. There's something up there. And I'm gonna find out what it is, despite me having a hard time platforming over here. Okay, we got some kind of checkpoint. This feels very bossy. Yeah, something's happening. Oh, that's a lot of bugs. We should probably switch to the machine gun. Ow. I, I, take cover. Oh, I can spray their blood all over the wall. That's helpful. I'm on death's doorstep right now. But, okay, we did it. That was close. What do I have, like, three health left? Oh, great. Two. One. I died. Just gotta stay close. Make sure we also don't get lit up. These things pack a punch. Oh, I think I accidentally murdered one bird, so I guess we'll save the other one. I keep accidentally shooting birds. I guess that's part of the uh, the experience. You have to try not to kill them so you can save them because you probably get better things or collectibles or items or whatever it is for saving them. There he is, the big boy. Oh, we're gonna strafe. Okay, this is cool. I've been playing a lot of Doom 64 lately, so I feel like this is right up my alley. I was gonna say, I have a feeling he's not dead, but he killed over and disappeared. What is going on in there? Some kind of ant nightclub. And look at that, this time we didn't kill a single bird. Look at us, moving up in the world. And we killed four birds. So, we, we saved somebody. Who, who's this little fella? Who are you? Oh, it's, it's his girlfriend. Oh, this is adorable. I might cry. This is the cutest thing I've ever seen until you remember that he's about to whip out that rocket launcher. He's like, you see what happened? They killed everybody. Everyone is dead. Anyway, thank you to Chameleon Games for sponsoring this video. If you guys want to pick up Tamarin for yourself, it's available now on PS4 and PC. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time.